welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for clicking on this video and checking it out. I'm very excited to share some CC that I found recently. I'm really in love with these items I've downloaded and I think you guys might be too. So if you are into Max's Match CC, definitely keep watching. All the links will be down below for you guys. I think I have over 100 items here, so I'm excited to just jump in. But we have this first hair here, which is super cute and short. It's probably more for masculine sims, but I think it looks really nice on feminine sims as well. And this one is really pretty. I think these kind of came in a pack, most of them. I think this one I downloaded on its own, but these two I believe came in a pack. But yeah, they just got these long pieces in the front and it is a very long hairstyle too, but really cute. I love this one too. Or no, these probably came together actually now that I'm thinking about it because they're like kind of the same just with this headband or um, handkerchief, bandana, I don't know. But uh, it's really cute though. Here I have some CC to change the color of it so you can really change it up however you'd like. This hair really reminded me of Esmeralda from The Hunchback of Notre Dame, so I thought that was really cute. This one here is some pigtails, some braided pigtails, and you have one version where they're both in the front and then one where it's kind of tucked behind. Here we just have a little hair accessory that changes the color of one of the sides of the um, style, so you have can kind of do whatever color here you want, which is really cool. This one here is really pretty. I love how it's been pulled back. It's just very simple. We'll look at a few colors here. It's really, really nice. And then here's a set that was like a springtime set. And so there's a few hairs from it. This one's really cute. I love how short it is. I love the little bun in the back. And then this one's really pretty with this long ponytail. Oh, I love it. And it looks like there's some type of bow accessory. So I think I'm going to check that out here. We have, it's like, a, oh, it's a little scrunchie. Oh, that's so cute. I love scrunchies in real life and I love them in the Sims as well. Really, really pretty. And here we have a little, oh, two buns with a headband. So we'll check out some colors and then they have different um, accessory colors for the headbands. We'll check those out as well. Here it is. So We've just got, you know, the same kind of color scheme, but you can really change it up to whatever outfit you're wearing. So for her outfit right here, I'd probably do something like this, something neutral to tie in since that's kind of her outfit. This next hair, I really love this style. It's so pretty. I love the little pieces in the front. I think they look so nice. And then this style is really fun too. I have a few styles like this in my game already, but this one has some bangs and some like little pieces that come down in the front. Um, but yeah, I just really think this is cute. And then I have a quite a few hairs from Sim Mandy. I love this one. I love how simple it is and it's kind of a side part, which I think we need more of in the game. This next one is another one by Simandy and it's pretty long. It's kind of got a blunt cut, I would say, to it. And it's got some bangs, but just a different style. I don't have too many like this in my game, so I thought that was nice. And then another one here, which I'm really excited about this one. So half of it is like holographic or there is one swatch where it can be. So let's give her like a white color and then let's check out that ombre effect. Okay, so here they are here. There are two styles. So you have just regular hair colors and some fun ones too, but not quite as fun as this style. It's like holographic, it's so cool. Let's do some of these like really pretty colors. Got like some purples. Oh my gosh, look how pretty that is. <gasps> that is so pretty, oh my goodness. And we've got like another pink color. I really love these like this peach, um, peach tone. It's so pretty, oh my goodness. I definitely wanna make a sim with that. That's probably gonna be my next um, thing to do. It's so cute. So that hair is really awesome. For the next hair, we have some braids, which I really love this style too. I have quite a few styles like this in my game already, so it's nothing new, but there are some accessories with it that I'm very excited about. So let me find it. It's in hats and it's these bows, which are so cute. Oh my gosh, I love it. 
There's so many different colors. You can just put them with any outfit to match the outfit. It's just really cute. And then this style is really fun. It's very curly and kind of wispy, I would say. This one has so many different colors. There's some like neutral ones. Um, you know more normal toned ones and then we've got like the crazy fun colorful ones, which is really fun <laughs> But we've got that one and then this is really pretty too. I love how simple it is I love the pieces in the front kind of like they're not bangs, but side pieces I guess and it's got a little bun And also there is an accessory with this where I think the oh, it's the roots that actually changed the color so we could do like some green like Billie Eilish. I think that's really cool. And actually this hairstyle has an accessory. It's got a little like twig branch in the back and you have some different colors there. But yeah, I just, I think it's cute. So yeah, that one's really fun. And then we have a few hairs here by Grim Cookies. So this first one is a bun and I'll just show you a few colors here. It's pretty simple, but it's really nice. And I think it'll fit for a lot of Sims. The second one is, oh, do I still have, sorry, I still had an accessory on, but this is a pretty simple style. And I, I think I have quite a few hairs in my game like this, but I like that this is longer in the front and it matches the length in the back, which I think is really cool, but it's just so pretty. I don't mind having, you know, quite a few styles like this. I think it's really nice. And then this one is so cute. It's a short style. It's from Clumsy Alien. I love their content but we'll just show off a few colors. I think it's so cute. I love the bun on top. And then this one I really loved. I loved how full it is and the bangs and it's just really cool. So we've got that one as well. And those are for all the hairs for the female Sims. So I gave her a simple style here and we're gonna check out some of these hats, which there is one that is hair or yeah, hair compatible. And then there's one that's not, so um, I've downloaded both. But this is part of the missed opportunity pack that the Sims content creator community is creating. And I really love this so much. I wanted this one to win. Out of all the hats, this was definitely one of my favorites. But yeah, this is just so, so cute. I love the different colors and especially these like two-toned ones. Oh my gosh, really cute. And I'll show you this one too, but I think they have pretty much the same swatches. It's just a little closer to the face. And then my final item is this backpack, which I'm very excited about because for some reason when, well, when Discover University was coming out, I really wanted backpacks and we weren't getting that. We got it with um, University Life from The Sims 3. So that was something I was really looking forward to. But since we didn't get it, I was gonna try to find accessories for it. I think I have one in my game, but this one is definitely more Max's Match, which I really appreciate but yeah just really cute and there's like little um, pins on it which is so cute little alien ones which I think would actually be perfect for Aurora so I think I'm gonna put that on her um, when I get back into game but yeah that's really cute so I've changed her into a shorter hairstyle so we can check out these earrings that I've downloaded I think these are from Ridgeport and oh that one doesn't have any color swatches but this one I think does which I just love how basic and simple these are these are really really nice and I actually really love the colors that they come in And then this one as well is even more basic, but I really love it. Oh, it's just so cool. So that's all of the hats and the hair accessories. Let's move on to makeup. I did download a little bit of makeup. I'm gonna take off her eyeliner for now so we can really see the makeup. But here is, this is by Cryptic Sim and they just had an eyeshadow and a lip pack that I downloaded. They're not too dramatic, which I really appreciate because I can put them on a lot of different Sims and use them for, you know, everyday wear, which is awesome. And yeah, I just love these colors they have, especially this one's really pretty, the pinky, like pinky peach color. And then the lipsticks are pretty neutral. I think they don't change the lips up too much, which I actually like. Um, yeah, just different and kind of just as like a lip stain almost I would say or a lip tint So yeah, really cool. So now we're gonna move on into clothing I have a few sets of clothes here So this came with one of the sets I downloaded links will be below like I said, but we've got this like dress here Which is actually a top now that I'm thinking about it because this is in the top section So you could definitely put some pants or another skirt or something underneath, which is really cool This next item I love so much. I actually have a top that's very similar to this in my game already But I love the sheer sleeves. I think that is so pretty. So let's check out some colors here um, And then I also downloaded this one which has some different colors of course it's a recolor 
And then it also has some patterns that I really, really liked. A lot of floral patterns that are perfect for this time of year. Oh, I really love these. I actually want to look at all of them. <laughs> oh, I just love the sleeves too. It's so pretty and like all the roses. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that's really pretty. I think you could dress this up or make it more casual too. You could definitely dress it up and put like a really nice skirt, maybe a long skirt, and I think that'd be really, really nice. This next one, I think this came in a pack as well. We've got some, this is a long sleeve, like turtleneck, and it looks like it does tuck in to whatever bottoms you have on, which is really nice. And then we've also got another bodysuit here. This one is so pretty. I love this top that we got. I can't, oh no, it was a dress actually um, from, from City Living, is that right? But yes, this is so pretty. I could see this underneath a blazer. I think that'd be really, really nice with some like jeans or some slacks. I think it'd be so pretty. And this next top is also in another pack, a pretty big pack actually. And this is like an off the shoulder top that is really casual, but really nice, like a simple basic that can go with a lot of different outfits and bottoms. So very awesome. This next one, I actually have something pretty similar in my game, but I don't mind having another style of this. I think this is really nice. So this one here is the same top as the first one, just longer sleeves. And I actually like the sleeves, how they're kind of scalloped. I think that's really pretty, but a lot of different colors you can kind of play around with. And then this is the same top as this one, just the long sleeves as well and really cute it actually has the same sleeves or similar sleeves anyway to this one i think but it's not sheer of course and here we have another top i love the tie in the front i think this is perfect for a hot weather outfit or just lounging around the house maybe even sleepwear and then here's some more items from clumsy alien i just love their content and it looks like it is pretty exposed, so you could always put like an undershirt underneath. I really love these designs though. And then another shirt where there's a tie in the front. I love these styles, and it looks like there's something actually here on the shoulder area. I wonder, oh, it's distressed, I believe. That's really cute. So this might be like a vintage top, maybe something that your sim has thrifted, which is a really cute idea. But yeah, I really love these stripes. They're so cute. So there's that top and then we have this one here from Richport as well. I believe I have a dress already that is actually with this style. Um, so this is just the top version of it which is really cool. So I'm just going to give her a basic top here and we can go and check the bottoms out. Here is a skirt. Oh my gosh I love this design so much. This is so fun. It's kind of abstract some of them and wow it is really cool. A lot of different styles that you can play around with. And this is definitely part of that spring pack, which I think is so perfect. Here's some shorts. These are really nice, very high-waisted. I love all the buttons in the front. And then we have a skirt as well. A lot of different colors here. I definitely have things like this already, but I think this is really nicely made and it probably has different colors than the ones that I already have, so much appreciated. And I went ahead and changed the top for this one because this one ha comes up a little higher and also has just some details. I really love this next skirt. I think it's so cute and it's different than a lot that I have in the game. I think this might be a mesh from the pants or actually it was a full body outfit that we got from that pack or that patch forever ago. Um, but yeah, it's just really cute. I love it in a skirt option. And next we have these jeans which are pretty wide leg I would say and they come down pretty far. Um, and they're very high-waisted as well, so I think these are cute. I have some items like this too, but I think these are really nicely made, and I love everything Clumsy Alien makes. They're, they have really amazing content, so um, yeah, these are really cute. And next we have this overall outfit, and I think this is so nice. I have a lot already that kind of fall off the shoulder on one strap, so this one is different than those, and I really appreciate that. Yeah, this one's just really cool. And then we have these skirts, which are from the Missed Opportunity Pack as well. And I think these are amazing. I love these so much. I love the frayed edge here. So cool. And a bunch of different colors. Well, a bunch of different denim colors. Here is the one that we were supposed to, or the one we were voting on, um, but it didn't make it. So this has like the lace detail, really pretty. 
I love the pockets, the like lace on the edge. And then we have an option where it doesn't have the flowers on the skirt, which I think is really cool. So I changed her back into a bodysuit and our last item here is this skirt, which is so cute. It's sheer as well. Um, yeah, I just think this is really, really nice. So it basically just comes in white, gray and black. Um, but yeah, that's just really cute. And so for the accessories for full body, we just have this bodysuit that I'm kind of showing off here. So you can use it as a top or you can use it as an accessory, which I think is really cool. And then for this accessory, it's actually a bow for this skirt. So you can kind of change the color of the bow and you can change the skirt as well. So you can have all kinds of different styles. I really enjoy that CC creators do that often where you can always change up the accessories on an item, especially since we don't have the color wheel. This is one more way that we can kind of have a little more freedom with creating our Sims. So I just changed her into a male Sim and I'm just gonna show you what options I have for the males. But here we have that same hairstyle, which I think looks really, really nice on the male Sims. And then this one as well. So here's just some colors for that. As far as hats go, we have the same hats that we had for the female Sims. And here's one that shows the hair. So yeah, really cute. So for clothing, we have this sweater here, which I think is so nice. And I really love the texture on it and the colors too, especially this like teal color. I think that's really, really cute. And here we have just a basic t-shirt and a jacket over top with maybe a little pocket here, which I think is nice. And then this top has some really fun patterns, a lot of like paintings, which is really cool for maybe your artsy Sims. And then we have just the basics as well. And then for pants, we just have a pair of slacks, which these are really nice for the male Sims. I love that you have the basic option and then more of like a corduroy option as well. And a lot of different colors too. So that's really, really cool. And it looks really good with that top as well. And I went ahead and changed them into a little child. So we have these same hats. Um, this is a separate link. So I have that down below for you. So you'll have to download the adult hats and the children hats as well, because I think it uses the mesh. But yeah, I just love these for the kids Sims. Oh my gosh, this is so perfect. I really hope that, I think I said this in one of my other videos, but I hope with the knitting pack, we have the option to make custom content craftable as well. Cause I think this would be so nice to have it be craftable. So we'll have to see if that's a thing, but yeah, I just think these are really cute. But I have one extra special piece of CC and I'm really excited about it. So we're gonna go into the cat's clothing. So someone did create the sweaters that we had on the voting and I just love this so much. They created the little headband, it's so cute. There's so many colors too, which is kind of crazy. But yeah, this is just so, so cute. And the sweater too, oh my gosh. Even the sweater on its own is just really cute, but the headband just is like, the extra, extra touch here. It's really, oh, I love this color. And then they also made the other one as well, which is really cute as well. And we've got all these different colors. But yeah, I just wanted to share this with you guys because I know a lot of people were disappointed we didn't get this, but on the bright side, now we have it for free. And I think it looks just as good as it would have looked if EA had created it. So really excited about this. Um, I had to share that with you guys. I think that is it for my CC haul. It is a little bit shorter, but I was just really excited to get some new items for my game. It always feels very therapeutic to do some CC shopping. So I really enjoyed it and I really enjoyed sharing it with you guys, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you all very, very soon. Bye.